Star Trek had some science in it, I thought. Or Just some science that had yet to come that we have now and some other science we know we ain't never getting, right? <laughs> like, uh, I like the warp drive. Who, who doesn't like who the doesn't warp drive? Who doesn't like the warp now, drive? Now, let me confess publicly right now. I have described the warp drive incorrectly in my past. <gasps> <laughs> That's it. <laughs> I'm sorry. I, I can't work under okay. these conditions. Okay. I, when I first knew of the warp drive from the original series, I'm thinking, well, they're warping space, just like I would fold this piece of paper. Just no. like if you're trying to get across the galaxy, which is 100,000 light years across, if it's our at the Milky Way, and you, and so you warp the space like that. That right? is so wrong. But I, no, I'm, I'm, you I'm you wrap the Enterprise but, in a subspace but, field and know, then you send it faster finish, than let light. Let me finish how wrong I was. Ah. So, so you'd warp the space and then you travel through a little wormhole across, and, then, wormhole. and then you unfold it and then you get across the galaxy during the TV commercial and it wouldn't take 100,000 years. Can okay? I? So then, so, so people must have been timid because I, I was saying that for years mm. until some like, I, some, I, I was at Comic-Con and some Star Trek people met me in an alley, and they- <laughs> I can and see like, it, I can see it! And they had the, what is the, the, the- Batless? What's that weapon that the- The, 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 the Batless. Batless. Yeah, yeah. Batless is the big one, the Mechless is a little one. Yeah. Oh. Wow. Tell me how the warp drive works. What happens is that the warp nacelles create a subspace field around the ship, which allows it then to slide through ordinary space faster than light. Okay, so the warp factors is how fast you're able to slide through this subspace stuff. So how, what are they warping? It's a complete fabrication. Well, at least mine had... Yours had a tie. My, my, this, you this, didn't use your tie. This, warp, is, this is real. The warp thing is a bubble. They at call least it a warp I'm describing bubble. something that's real. So, at, so, so here's... Of course. It. So I was wrong about the show. Yes. I, I, and I beg forgiveness. But you mm. look good doing it. But <laughs> if we ever gonna warp space, it's gonna be something like this. Maybe. Maybe. What if we use... Oh, yeah, I mean, yeah, yeah. <laughs> what if we use quantum wave technology? Quantum wave or, or quantum teleportation, whatever. Yeah. I'm, I'm down with that. Okay. We'll now, do a whole show with that. The, the point is that the idea that we can bend space easier than we can bend ourselves seems to me backwards. But that's just the physicist in me. What do I know?